Welcome everyone. About to continue what we were doing last time here. Go to the Dane Stoop. In Angolia. Know the witch. Suffering hard times, I see. What's happening? Finier? Oh, no, not unless Halfton sent you. Whoever you are, I want to know why there's no king on East Anglia's throne. Because the man in question ain't been married yet. Once he is, East Anglia will have its king. And little else. Which man? <sighs> You know, stranger, you interrupted a beautiful dream. I was sailing through Helheim, drifting on a ship of fire. Dreams of death often run ahead of the real thing. Oh, <laughs> wouldn't that be a burden off my shoulders? What business have you with the backwater king, anyway? Danes from here attacked my clan. I want to know why and how to make sure it never happens again. Ah, that would be Ruid's clan. They killed the last man I put here, Adelstan. I suspect they'll do the same to our next monarch. A Dane who cannot keep the Danes in line? Not much of a steward, are you? If I knew how, I'd have rid our lands of them long ago. Ruid's clan plagues us all, Dane and Saxon alike. You are the sorriest soldier I've met in this country. Kick your king in the arse and fight back. He needs more than a kicking. He's got nothing he should have to win this fight. No courage, no army, no charisma. If he wants to live longer than a season, he'll need the backing of his bride's family, which he hasn't. They loathe the maggot. Who is he, your king maggot? Ah, uh, Oswald of Elmenham. He was King Edmund's council before the invasions. And like it or not, he's the last Saxon noble with any sway. Why not crown a Dane instead? Half done, Jarl, made it clear. He wants a Saxon king married to a Dane, for a greater show of unity. But Oswald's not the sort of man you'd chase into battle with a grin. He's soft, and the settled Danes don't trust him. Where is he now? I'll get the measure of him, see what I can do. You just missed him. He's headed for Elmenham just now, pleading once again for peace. If you go by the north gates and along the road, you may catch him. Wasn't 
I built myself a home here. Ruid's clan attacked us as well. Oh, how nice to have a home to speak of, man. Mine was burned to the ground years ago. And by home, I wonder. Please, all of you, be we Dana Saxon, we all have land to till and home to keep. Without fear of Ruid's violence. Till they break the peace with another bleeding raid. Nonsense. Their homes are here now. Same as ours, our futures run together, not apart. So what are these Danes attacking us, eh? What will you do about them? When I am king... <laughs> when I am your king, king, I'll set things right. You will be king when I am a flying troll. I am Eivor of the Raven Clan. Are you Oswald? I am. You're not here to kill me, are you? I am not in the habit of killing kings, but I do like meeting them. I am Oswald, yes. For as long as I can hold out. So what happened here, Oswald? A clan led by a Dane called Ruid attacked this morning. They've been sacking farms and hamlets across East Anglia for some time now, growing more brazen by the day. Do they know this is Helfden's land? They must. They just don't care. Their chaos has touched my home as well, and I am here to see that it does not happen again. Lately, I've come to learn you are the hook that all hopes hang upon. As king, you could unite all Saxons and friendly Danes. A minor weight to bear, isn't it? Who else if not a king should bear it? Travel with me, Eivor. We can discuss my tenuous future on the road home. What begs your attention in Elmenham? Wedding preparations. Elmam is on guard as we ready my marriage to the Dane woman Valdis. She's a cosmic. Matched marriage can forge a strong alliance. So what's the holdup? The holdup? I don't yet have permission to marry Valdis. Her brothers don't approve of me. <laughs> Why would it be so slow? Slow down. Something is not quite right here. Hold. There is smoke ahead. That's Beatley. It could be the same. The guards here are vigilant. That should be the last of these pig-faced cowards. Oswald will be relieved to know of this.
Pikey? Ruiz clan. They left none alive. God rest their souls. I'm needed at home to make yet another fruitless attempt to impress my betrothed family. Show more grit than you're showing me now, and they may start to like you. Yes, sorry, I'm just shaken. If you joined us at dinner, that might ease their minds a touch. Think about it. My doors are open to you. I'll be happy to join you. Tell me when and where. Wonderful. Visit us in Elmham whenever you have time. It's worse here than I feared. Wild is for everybody. What? No! A healthy scene. Oswald, where is this dinner you promised me? Eivor! You came! Dinner will still be served, but I'm afraid you are too early. My intended and her family are not ready. This intended of yours, Oswald. Who is she? One of love or politics? Her name is Valdis. And people don't marry for love these days, Eivor. This is an arrangement for East Anglia's benefit. She's from a Dane family whose military might is not to be trifled with. But her brothers... Their motives are selfish. Why don't you ever look around and come back later? Dinner will not disappoint. Oh, I'm sure. A healthy seeming Hello, town Dane. is also Can't trust that. Well, sure. Be kind, yeah? As Christ would command. I'm trying to waste time a little bit to do it for my fall, so. Let's see what this is. It's in the afternoon, so it should be that long. Join battle together and reap glory's bounty. Raid with me, warrior, for plunder, glory, and Valhalla. Go, my eyes. 
It's almost that time. It's probably boring to watch, but just wasting time, you know. You're almost there. Information? I have it. Do you need it? There is the matter of my fee. All right. Oh, that's kind of dumb. Now, show me your map. There is a place here.
allergies, man. I'm kicking in so bad right now. Best not to draw attention here. Magic guys or something? Mm. Sounds pretty crazy. Mm. We'll do one more of these and then we'll definitely go. This is definitely not falling off. child. So weird. Hey, All right. That was really weird. It's teleporting for a reason. Okay. Yeah, that was weird. Ladies, this is a day of peace and fraternity. I asked you here to Elmenham to our generosity. Been here, our steward, to our guests of honor, Broth here and Broder, and to my lovely bride to be, Valdis. You get to plow our sister because Halfton commands it, but you won't drag us into bed with you, you hear? Uh, Broder, the is... last Saxon king we backed. 
wasn't half as mushy as you, and we lost 150 men protecting his maggoty ass. Bro, dear. If you're going to be rude, then I must ask you to leave. This is my home. I won't be insulted here. <laughs> is that why you've come? To back the Thane who smells of goat shit and cheap pebbles. <laughs> I'm sorry, did you say something? Do I bore you, Wolfkist? I'm here to protect my clan. If that means helping your king secure his throne, well, so be it. <laughs> You'd be safer crowning the throne. It's made of less wood than, uh, this one. We'd all be safer if you had the stones to stand up to Ruet's clan. But between the pair of you, I can't see a single nugget. You watch your tongue, Wolfkist, or you'll find it freed of your face! So... Easily wounded by words. Imagine the ruin my axe would inflict on your flaccid ego. My flaccid what? Please stop this. You heard me. That's it. Ridiculous! Absurd! What the hell? Look at this thing again. Two gets one, two. To be so full of bigger This is not how we settle disputes in East Anglia. Brother, stop this or I have bumped your asses. That was kind of tricky. I think it was. Stop! Too all of you! That's enough fun for tonight! If that's all you've got, it's little wonder East Anglia's in the state it is. <laughs> you are weak, sheep herder. The Norse friend here can't change that. We are better off without a king. Well, that's me done. I think I prefer dream nonsense to these alehouse brawls. What a waste of time and good mead. These brothers will never back me in my claim. This dance is just beginning, Oswald. Get some rest. You'll need your energy. And uh, will I see you in the morning? We have much to discuss, I think. I'll find a place to lay my head. And Eivor, if you can help me right this situation, you'll have a strong alliance with East Anglia. That much, I promise. Seems Oswald has set out for the day. I should have a word with him. Ooh, let's find out. Clear the mess in the longhouse and wait. All this water you can find. Eivor, good to see. Sunan, guide me. Good to see you. <gasps> Fear this measure of death. My feet. Ah, good morning. Upright and early. You can labor like a thrall, but you're no good with feasts. Not a good start for a king. No, indeed. I find a solitary comfort in my menial labors. Not something a king should admit to, I suppose. What are you even doing? The brothers shamed you at dinner. It's your duty to answer their insults. Don't let the matter lay unresolved. Oh, it was a petty row with henhouse wolves. I'd sooner answer the move a cow than worry about their insults. I have a wedding to plan and a kingdom to save. 
I haven't time to suffer fools. They betrayed your hospitality, Oswald. Where I'm from, that's a grave insult. Well, well. Here's the mud-soaked Saxon who's been taxing my patience. Ah, uh, steward Finnair. I know I failed to impress at dinner yesterday eve, but fear not. The Danes will come around in time. You stay claim to the thr throne, you dazed a dog with no bone. If Lord Halfdown were here, he'd squeeze ale from a stove. Yelling, Finner, my dranger, stick this cur in the ground. All mewling and spitting, here's Finnir, the hound. He has bark, but no bite, just a puppy I've found. <laughs> What just happened? That's flighting, Oswald. Using rhythm and rhyme to lay a man flat. Try it. Match his verse. There's no man you can lead, you dunce of the third. So weird. Uh, I'm glutton you are. Just stop eating your words. Not bad. Not bad. He's got the wit of a boa, so when he insults you, make him feel stupid. When I'm done with you, Kerr, you'll be raven flock food. But your brain's soaked in mead, and your... Heads made of wood. Wood! Heads made of wood! He's an ugly puss, so when he brags, hit him back with something about his looks. I hail from the north, where the winters are season. But you're foul. You're a blister. You're a... a... Plague-ridden lesion. Oh, yes, that's very good. Plague-ridden lesion. Under all that tough posturing is a sniveling boy, so dig deep. When he brags, take a jab at his manhood. I've sailed squalls and north winds. You, not even a breeze. But the winds that you sail... Blow between both your knees. Blow between both your... Oh, you mean farting? <laughs> Oswald, my boy, you're useless without your raven. This one's wrong for the throne. He's too soft and too tame. Hit him back and make it personal. Attack his mother. When you crawled from the womb, you were ugly and lame. Your poor mother, she fainted away from the shame. Well spoken. Before sword clash and blood flow, we destroy our enemies with well-timed words. You have a talent for verse, I'll give you that. But how long will that silver tongue hold up against an iron axe? Let's find out, Finnir. I challenge you to a home gang. You don't mean that, Oswald. That's a fight to settle disputes, no? A home gang. A fight to the death, yes. Let's talk it out, then. <laughs> Too late. The challenge has been made. But a fight against Finir would not be anything to boast about. You'll fight me. Hold on, this is... That said, I should not be seen killing a Saxon in the streets of Elmenham. There's a nice islet down river, near Seahenge. Water will wash the blood clean away. Prepare the square, and we'll meet you there. I hope you're ready. Oh, I have to be. Just give me a moment to mentally prepare. Do not make us wait long. It would not be kingly. Yeah, this doesn't make any sense to me. I don't get any of all this. Just type of words, I'm gonna kill it.
the water. Uh, yeah, there he goes. Bye. Long time to swim, if you think about it. You made it. <gasps> Done. Done. You what? still got the touch for drawing a square. I've been in East Anglia many summers now, but I'd always be a Dane. Must we do this, Avel? Strength and courage are always a boon, Oswald. You'll need both if you want the Danes to accept you as a king. True strength comes from resolve, Eivor. It speaks to us, a stern voice from within. I have never heard of talking guts, but a swift axe would silence that inner voice in seconds. You must be prepared. Wait, you're unarmed? Just do your best. I'll be fine. We will forge mm -hmm. a king out of you yet. Don't hold back. You felt that one. I'm still here. Oh, was that too hard? To it was a good this strike. Keep going. Elders. Don't you think you want me to fight? the Danes to follow this poor belly? I'm... I'm still breathing, aren't I? Show me what you can do, Saxon. I'll do what I need to do. Come now. You'll never be king at this rate. Is this the best East Anglia has to offer? Yes, and I'll... I'll prove it! Come on, fight! If it's a fight you seek... And that was dumb. Eivor is the victor. But you've shown us something, Oswald. Stay down, Oswald. That's enough. I will... I will not stay down! You fought bravely. Not with great skill, but with spirit. And courage. Always push back with even if you have to get dirty, even if you must break the rules. Because there are no rules. Not if you answer a challenge head on. That's where honor lies. Not winning the fight, but living through it. A seaside brawl won't change the brothers' minds. Oswald must show results. We dress old wrongs. Fight back against Ruid and his men. The raiders who attack Beatley have a camp down the coast. The sooner we remove them, the better. That would go a long way to building you up. And if you brought gifts for the brothers, just do spoils that, just from the raid, they'd be in your debt. Time to wet your blade, Oswald. Eivor, I expect your longship crew could help with this attack. Let the sail out! Looks like we kind of just did that. But... More sail! No one has been willing to take a stand against Ruid's clan before. We're a kingdom of farmers and merchants. Even farmers and merchants can fight when led by the right person. I hope your faith in pig farmers is not misplaced, Abel. There is work to do, yes. But we will rise to meet Ruid's clan. 
God will make so. <laughs> Nicely. Find something? There's a crate of hack silver here. More than enough to make everyone happy. We'll take it to the ship. A hard one fight. The first of many, Oswald. Have you the will to keep it up? I'm not a big fan of this whole story. This guy. is my gift to the Come brothers. On. I have more than enough wealth in Elmham to widen their eyes, but this will be a symbol of my commitment to our fight. It's a good start. Take one or the witch, then send for the brothers. I'll meet you there.
All right, guys, we'll uh, stop here. Next episode, we'll get continuation of the story. Like I guess I'm not a big fan of this one, but eh, you gotta do what you gotta do. Until next time, bye.